Moline High School students spent the afternoon getting a real life history lesson. The school hosting a lecture and roundtable discussion about the war in Ukraine. And News 8's Jenna Webster shares the experience these students weren't expecting to learn today firsthand. It's new tonight on News 8 at 10. From an auditorium in Moline. I have to go to a place where I can save her. Just a second. These high school students listened. Can you hear that? To Russia's latest attack on Ukraine happened live. <laughs> but not on the news. It's two explosions. Oh, it's, it's not far from my house. I should check my windows. They're on a Zoom call with a woman named Daria. It's about five blocks from my house. She lives in Ukraine in Odessa. I was terrified for her. I, I, um, I kind of wanted her to just end the call and get to somewhere safe as soon as she could. It's history class happening in real time. I think I've just felt so separated from this whole, I, this whole thing because it's Eastern Europe. I mean, we, we're America. That's so far away from us, and it really showed me that we're involved too. Students were able to ask Daria questions about what she's experiencing and how the war has impacted her. It took them three days to go 50 miles. I think that was like a really big thing. Like, oh, they like are, it's like an actual war. Like it is bad. We're seeing it, but what are we doing about it? Dr. Cecilia Rakusek led the lecture and knows Daria well. So we talk twice a day and sometimes more. And, uh, you know, she tries not to tell me everything because I get worried. But it's a reality Rakusek says students need to know about because it's gonna keep happening until we have the leaders in our future generation to be here to preserve freedom and democracy. So that history doesn't repeat itself again. We have to stay unified. Um, that's how we prevent this from happening. In Moline, Jenna Webster, WQAD News 8. Thank you, Jenna. The event was hosted by the Moline High School History Club.